All right, everyone, welcome to another edition of Chris's Corner, your home for fantasy talk, nerd talk, movie talk, and everything else across the spectrum. So let's get into it. You guys know I'm a big action buff. Uh, love, I'm a big movie buff all together, but y'all know I love the action genre more than anything. So tonight is, uh, today is January 11th. Tonight I had the uh, you know, pleasure of seeing the movie The Beekeeper with my boy Jason Statham. And y'all know I'm a big Statham fan, been following him for a very long time. So... In this movie, uh, it's actually called The Beekeeper. There's a reason why they actually call it that. So the premise starts off, uh, is basically built around a legend that for the beekeeper, there's a hive. So the United States uh, government, but organizations as a whole, uh, basically are the beehive. And then basically the assembly to that structure of how the actual beehive works, uh, there's a queen bee up uh, at top. And then you have your workers, you, you have the drones, you also have the honeybees as well as others. And... Basically, as JJ stated as the beekeeper, he's the guy that when the organization itself, meaning like the actual hive, when the organization, uh, all the rules fall apart and there's nothing else to do, they actually send him in and he released himself as basically the honeybee that actually comes in and can re the system so that is back to homeostasis. So starting off with the movie, it... Um, it you know it starts off a little mellow and they bring the story in just to bring it together more just to give some more context and then once a situation happened and Jason Statham suffers a loss he goes out on a rampage just uh, vengeance in, in the night pretty much and during the day as well and he just goes off on everyone just say hey. he and then basically he's fighting for the little guy for. You know, these big, massive companies that have, you actually seen in real life that have, like, taken advantage of the little people. And I, I mean, like, senior citizens, elders, you know, younger people, that you know, pe folks that are naive. And they just rip people off as far as, like, finances and assets, equity, things of that nature. So he takes it upon himself to just go out and recorrect the system as a whole all the way up to the top of the chain. And it's a great story. They, they put it well together. A uh, few nice actors in there. Of course, you have Jason Statham himself. You have Jeremy Irons. You have Bobby Naderi. You have Felicia Rashad. You have uh, Josh Hutcherson in the movie, as, and along with a, a supporting cast of other people in there. But uh, my my straight off the gate, I'm going to give it an 8.5. You guys know I love action movies. That's probably a little high for some, but I do implore you to go see the movie. You'll definitely enjoy it. It's a great story, and it's a lot of action, a lot of, you know, bang bang put them up kicking you know that's how it is in the movie so be sure to like and subscribe and thanks for watching chris's corner